We did. It's a West Ham throw. Tim Breaker, formerly with Luton, with it. Here's Bishop. Keane. Bishop. Nice play here. Harris. Now McAvenny! Great save by Grobola. A terrific bit of football all round. A lovely move by West Ham. And a close range header by Frank McAvenny that was saved superbly by Bruce Grobola. Harris. A long ball forward. Small is onside. He's gone past Nickel. Small. Another great save by Grobola. McMahon. That's a lovely ball by McMahon. And look at the race on here now for David Barrows. There are three green shirts waiting in the middle, including McGonaghan. And really he misstepped entirely when the goal looked to be at his mercy. And Liverpool could so easily have been a goal ahead then. Up to Small. Play to McAvenny. Away goes Small, galloping after this one. Look at Slater. Grobola may not get to this one. Grobola's away out of his goal. Now what sort of cross can Slater put in? Oh, just nicked away there. Keane comes in. It might come for Paris, and in the end, Liverpool get it away. But another excursion by Bruce Grobola. But Slater that time skinned him for pace, and Liverpool were in dire, dire danger. Knocked in there, just touched away brilliantly again. Tony Gale's header turned away superbly once more by Grobola. It was an afternoon when again Bruce did more right than wrong, and when the style of Liverpool's football was just right. Typically, there was a price to pay. Ian Rush didn't play again for three months.